everyone and thanks for tuning in to the second episode of The Artist. I'm Prakriti and today we have with us Raghav, the lead vocalist of Zaroon. Baatein teri karte huye थके सो जाता हूँ सिरहाने आसमां जाने कहाँ मुड़ जाती है देखते देखते तुझे ये गलियाँ तेरी तरह खुशबू चले तारे हमारी तरह रातों से मिले सुनी नहीं जमाने ने तेरी मेरी कहानियाँ कर दे कोई नवाजिश करम मेहरबानियाँ राघव वेलकम टू द शो वाई डोंट यू टेल अस अ लिटिल बिट अबाउट योर बैंड uh well thank you for having me here um it's been about 3 years since um i have made my own band mm. and um it's a mixture of uh, different uh, music attributes uh we try to mix in a little bit of sufi punjabi and um it's been going great so far people have been loving us so far so good uh since the time you started the band and uh, how how far do you think you have come with the band since it's only been 3 years Um well for 3 years it's been uh, really good uh, people have started to know us um you know our music is being appreciated our viewership has been going up the following has been uh, very loyal and has been growing so it's been going good so far How did you come up with the name Zaroon it's a very unusual word It actually is I mean uh, there was um, a lot of thought process behind this but uh, Zaroon basically means visitors so, in which um, language It's in Urdu, okay. uh, but it means uh, visitors. So basically, I uh, consider myself and my band as visitors because wherever we go, mm -hmm. we are like a part of the occasion for some time, and then we have to switch over to somewhere else. Oh, that's so I just felt that it's like a very apt uh, name for the band. Okay, how many people are there in the band? Uh, we six people for now, and um, so we have like a mixture of. Uh, flute sometimes mm. sometimes there's keyboards guitar and bass is always there mm. so we kind of uh, try to put in newer elements sometimes mm. adding on the seventh member or maybe the sixth uh, but um, the primary uh, backbone the guitar the bass the drums the percussions also which we have are um, always there but we just try to experiment more on the other attributes putting in saxophone mm -hmm. flute or something like that just to give in some more flavor mm -hmm. and what kind of places do you perform at um we're doing a lot of uh, club shows mm -hmm. uh we're into corporate shows as well weddings as well so we've been uh, doing shows all over from delhi across to uh, international shows as well so uh, yes we've been traveling a lot when you started off uh, with zaroon was it uh, comparatively easy or would you say that it was very difficult to get a gig a paid gig um i would say it was very difficult because uh, you know when you start you don't have a name of your own uh, nobody knows the band and um, it is very difficult uh, to get paid for a show mm. uh, you know uh, realistically when i started my first show and i did my first two three shows for free okay. because um, you know those were basically shows to build in your own profile mm -hmm. and just show the other people that this is the places that i have performed at so um, you know doing your first show and getting paid for it is uh, i don't think would be possible um, raghav can you sing us a few lines from one of your uh, favorite songs sure sure i would love to tu ki jaane pyar mera main kara intezar tera tu dil tu yu jaan meri मैं तेनु समझा की ना तेरे बाजो लगदा जी मेरे दिल ने चुन लिया ने तेरे दिल दिया रहा तू जो मेरे नाल तुरै ता तुर पै मेरी आसा 
जीना मेरा है मरना मेरा नाल तेरे सी कर एतबार मेरा मैं करा इंतजार तेरा तू दिल तू यू जान मेरी Uh, you perform at so many different kinds of places. So, uh, how's the audience there, and is it different everywhere? What kind of audience is it? The audience is uh, very different everywhere. I mean, um, for example, when we do club shows, the audience there is very different. There, some of them are there to enjoy music, some of them are basically there to um, hang out with friends mm. and have a few drinks, mm. enjoy the good food. Do you have any memorable experiences which you would like to share with our viewers? We actually have uh, a lot of uh, uh, stories which have happened with us, but um, one that I would like to share is, uh, uh, you know, we once went for a private show, mm -hmm. um, not in Delhi but somewhere out, and um, you know, people were got really drunk that time, and um, you know, usually how it happens in the weddings and everything that people come on stage mm -hmm. and start to sing with the singer mm -hmm. and start to dance and everything, so it got very. Uh, overloaded with a lot of people and there was a lot of pushing happening because everybody was dancing so i myself fell off stage oh my <laughs> and uh, two or three friends of theirs fell on me so um, but the show was still on and uh, we had a great time I the mean, show was still on you mean you just went back on stage and started singing? yeah you know you have to get up and uh, you know just pretend as if nothing happened but uh, yeah so the show went on and uh, it was a great great night i think we really had fun that <laughs> time Although I was a little injured, but <laughs> yeah, it was a great night. In terms of uh, number of performances that you do in a month and uh, your uh, rehearsals and everything, what does your schedule usually look like? Well, nothing is uh, exactly uh, fixed and decided. Mm -hmm. um, the sh frequency of shows keeps going up and down. Sometimes you get very busy and you're doing like about 12 to 15 shows a month. Mm -hmm. And uh, sometimes you're doing about 4 to 5, so the frequency is up and down. Uh, in terms of rehearsals, definitely the rehearsals go up when the shows are low and when you're very busy and occupied with the shows, that is the mm -hmm. time when you can't really rehearse a lot because there's a lot of traveling and mm -hmm. everything that is involved. But um, uh, yes, the schedule all over is um, a little busy because there are a lot of things when you're working on new music, which we are mm -hmm. uh, composing, composing new uh, music, uh, working on different uh, styles and attributes to work on in terms of music. Uh, Raghav, thank you so much for thank coming you. on the show and we really enjoyed having you Pleasure. and I'm sure that our viewers like me are looking forward to hearing your original compositions as well as seeing you perform on gigs. Very soon. So, let's end with a song then. Sure, sure, definitely. Sham <laughs> bhi जैस है नदी लहर लहर जैस बह रही है कोई अन कही कोई अनसुनी बात धीमे धीमे कह रही है कहीं ना कहीं जागी हुई है कोई आरजू कहीं ना Oh no.